Henriette. What do you see when you look at me? Who do you see when you look at me? Am I your mom, your love, your son? You call me Ben when everything is right. Anyone can be Ben when everything is all right. But when everything is not okay, when everything is wrong, there seems no love to be found. There seems no one to impersonate Ben for you. The smile disappears from your face. The spark disappears from your eyes. With a worried frown you walk away. You pull your hand away from mine and you go your own way. You're on your own mission, in your own world, where there is no place for me. You go from room to room, collecting the laundry you fold so perfectly, as if you are trying to fold your own life back into sense again. I have learned that when I cannot get through to you, you are in pain. And when you are in pain, your body must hurt so much that you don't want me to get too close to you. So I make sure that you have had your pain relief before I even think of coming near to assist you to the toilet or with a shower. You cannot remember how to toilet yourself any longer, but all your senses do realize it is unpleasant, something you should resist. You need a lot of gentle encouragement, a warm bath of love. I often find a way to enter your world with a song. And the moment I can reach you there, through your waterfall of words, my friendly touch invites you, so you can join me in a dance. Together we dance towards the bathroom. My kindness and my loud outpour of loving words seem to tickle your soul. It can hold your attention, but your focus easily leads away to a comb, a flannel to fold, or the rubbish bin. I need to give you time to make your bed, for you are a tidy lady. And if I take you away for my own sake, nothing will happen at all. And sometimes, when we are ready to go, you hop back onto your bed and just sit there, folding the bed linen. And I have to leave you there. When nothing seems to work at all and my trials seem to fail, I know that the pain must have returned of a chronic internal inflammation. I will pass it on to the nurse on duty so a doctor can come to check on you. Often antibiotics do their work and when you're back on track, you're as good as gold and smile and sing and I am glad to have you back. When Ben comes in, you beam of light. He is the love of your life. However far your thoughts have wandered off, something inside you still knows that you are his wife, that somehow you belong. You're holding hands and sing together songs from your rich and joyful past, reminiscing about the time spent in Africa, the teaching and the gift of maths. Your social skills and passion led you to do social work. And because your love for people was so strong, life offered you your four children to call your own, even though three of them were born to other parents. What do you see when you look at me? Who do you see when you look at me? Would you trust me to take care of you in the moments that you need me, even when you don't realize it? Would you confide in me? <laughs>